Okay, so now we're going to use the Extract Deltas plugin to to model corrective blend shapes for this big Buck Bunny character. Now, as before we saw, we've got this basic demo of the foot coming up with this ugly deformation. So this is how the Extract Deltas plugin works. Instead of having to duplicate this mesh manually and then unlock, there's a simple script here, which is just duplicate skin. That just does that for us all in one step, which is really lovely. So now all we have to do is come in and we actually sculpt on this blend shape, which is really lovely. Now you can do it in Mudbox, export it in Mudbox, fix it all up there, do it here. Um, so let's just do this very quickly. So I'm just going to use the Sculpt Polygon tool and we're gonna come in here with our operations and just um, hold down the Shift key, smooth this, uh, just smooth it out a little bit. And and try and get a bit of a better shape happening here. Just try and pull this section out. So I'll put this in fast forward now uh, so you don't have to watch me doing this, but I'll just give you the basics. Okay, so here we have a uh, corrective blend shape fix. Now I've just done that really quickly, so uh, I'd probably spend quite a bit of time getting that right, so it looks really lovely. But at the moment, we've got just a basic sort of uh, fixed shape happening here. I just might tweak this just a little bit more to bring it back in. I think you could just come down a little bit uh, there, maybe even use that to come out a bit. Uh, it's hard to say, so we can sort of use that as a starting point. And now I want to use the Extract Deltas plugin to uh, spit out our blend shape of what this actually looks like when it's placed at the front of the chain in a blend shape. So to do this, I believe we just select the original shape first and the second one second and just hit Extract Deltas. So that's as simple as it is. Now I can move this guy out here and you can see that all that work that we would have to originally do by eye um, has been done for us. And now we can uh, use this blend shape here, not this one, use this one to put in front of the chain on a blend shape. So select that and then this one second. Edit Deformers, Blend Shape. Make sure we're on the front of the chain and just hit Create. The front of the chain, of course, will put the blend shape down below the skin cluster. And we can now slide that on and it will actually magically match up identically with what we've just sculpted, which is beautiful. Now, of course, when that comes back down again, we can see that the blend shape is still on, so it's sort of hitting that. So just to make that work, and I'll, I'll show you how to do this auto automated in the next lesson, but in this lesson, uh, let's just do this really quickly by keying this manually. So I key it there on frame 40, and then key it off on frame zero. Key selected now, just to be a little bit clearer. I know that by default, I've got these auto tangent stuff happening and it really depends. I want that curve to match up with my joints, which it does have a nice ease in and ease out. So that's fine. Just double check that. Let's get our joints back. And now I can sort of watch that. And we've got this lovely corrective blend shape happening. So we don't have this ugly pinching area happening around that joint. Now I might spend some more time just cleaning that up properly, but as you can see, this works really well. And um, in the next lesson, we'll have a look at automating this uh, rather than keying it manually. Uh, so that's it for um, the Extract Deltas plugin. It's very easy to use uh, and a huge time saver.